What's going on YouTube family? Welcome back to another Dead Side video. Today I wanted to touch on the subject of AIs within Dead Side. If you've ever played Dead Side, then you'd probably agree that the AIs are a little bit OP. With that being said, it sparked my interest to look into this just a little further. Not only was I able to locate information about the AIs, but I also located information about where Dead Side was heading back in August of 2019. For the sake of keeping this video short, I'm gonna go ahead and get started. Back on August 2019, the Dead Side developers posted a video on their YouTube page describing how they were able to make their own AI system. The developer speaking in the video was proud to say that the AI system was designed to keep players on their toes. With that in mind, three types of different NPC activities were created, one of which was random encounters. These random encounters were spread out throughout the map with different radius sensors alerting the AIs when a player was close by. When these sensors are triggered, the AIs are automatically spawned onto the map and begin to search for the player in the area. Unlike many other AI based games, the AIs in Dead Side were designed to simulate a real player. The other two NPC activities were incorporated in the patrol as well as the missions that are spread out throughout the map. The question that most of you probably have is why are these AI characters so accurate with their shots? The reason behind their accuracy is that the Dead Side developers created their own sight system for the AIs. The sight system that was created was intended to mirror real life situations. The example of the real life situation that was used in the development video was a character standing behind a bush and how the AI was still able to see that character. The developer further explained that the position that you stand behind the bush would determine if the AI actually sees you or not. The developer also added that a running character is easier to get picked up by the AI than one that is walking. The developer in the video also added that they wanted both strong and dangerous AI characters that are able to set up an ambush on you. Apart from the AI system with the normal NPCs, you can hear the developer speaking about zombies in several different parts of the video, leading me to believe that zombies were initially part of the dead side game plan. Now I am not sure what happened that made them change course, but that is something that I figured I would share as well. One final topic that I wanted to touch on before the video ends is the fact that during this development video, they showcased the character actually going prone. So the prone feature I believe is already something that is completed but has not been implemented in the game just yet. Alright guys, this brings me to the end of the video. If you guys enjoyed the information that I shared with you, make sure to hit that like button down below and don't forget to subscribe to check out future videos. If you would like to watch the developer's video that I watched, I provided the link down in the description below so that you guys are able to watch it on your own time. Once again, thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next video.